The Abs of Summer, next on Global Pulse. A comparison of how broadcasters worldwide get silly in summer. <sighs> it's August, and there seems to be two types of stories that come out during the summer, silly and crazy. <laughs> Hi, I'm Erin Coker. In the United States, we got all kinds of crazy. Are you are you are you are you Adolf Hitler, like Barack Obama, also ruled by dictate. But around the world, summer news can also mean silly news. And silly can mean naked. <laughs> Germany kicked things off in May with a story about an advertisement that features Chancellor Angela Merkel in her underwear. Can somebody say Angie's secret? <laughs> Germany's ARD told it like this. Die Kanzlerin als Kurvenwunder. The voluptuous chancellor, Angela Merkel, shows a lot of skin. I don't think her boobs are that big. I've never paid attention to this. She always hides them behind her buttons. For a fashion campaign, the top politicians stripped down, involuntarily and without being asked. No wonder Bush wanted to give her a massage. <laughs> Merkel brought new meaning to government transparency, but in the Southern Hemisphere, summer happened six months ago in January. And so came Ecuador's president, Rafael Correa, as Tela Amazonas joked. We find a strong, robust man going for a swim in the emerald green waters of a lake. Don't you know who this manly chested leader with the big smile is? Who? Who? Ah! Yes, it's Rafito! Naked leaders have always been hot. Mao kicked off the trend when he swam the Yangtze River in 1966. Hugo Chavez had to be drawn topless. Ay caramba! By the looks of it, he isn't hiding any WMDs. And now there's Photoshop, so everybody can be naked. Like Kim Jong-il in this unlikely portrait with beer cans. Not exactly the PR coup the DPRK was hoping for. The French featured this image of a buff President Sarkozy. But France is famous for slimness, so the editors of the magazine airbrushed the president's love handles out of existence. <sighs> but nobody looks hotter under the sun than Russian Prime Minister Vladimir Putin. Oh, thank you. This guy takes his shirt off more times than Matthew McConaughey. Generating overheated stories like this one on Russia Today. Ooh. While most world leaders on a summer holiday might actively avoid the media, Russian Prime Minister Vladimir Putin invited the cameras to film him striding through the fields. He wore an Indiana Jones-style hat and rode a horse topless. Careful. It may only be a matter of time before Putin unveils his Sputnik. He nearly gave heat stroke to a breathless BBC. Every summer. The muscle man of Moscow seems to find new ways of being photographed in avid pursuit of perspiration. Vladimir Putin will be 57 in October. In a country where male life expectancy is less than 60, he looks in better physical shape than many much younger Russian men. Are American presidents too wimpy to compete? Barack Obama might have curbed military spending, but he wasn't afraid to show off his guns on his Hawaiian vacation, as CNN reported. Take a good hard look. Why did this photo generate so much fascination? Pretty simple. This guy is young, fit, trim, and he looks pretty good in a bathing suit. CNN even convened a panel of experts to discuss the presidential pecs. And Russia countered quickly, describing an online contest. Drudge Report has started a shirtless competition. More than 87,000 people have voted so far on whom they like best with their shirt off. Obama or Putin? And despite being nine years older, the Russian premier has taken a clear lead. Stephen Colbert put it all in perspective. With the challenge from Putin, Mr. President, you have got to up the ante. Maybe your next press conference. <laughs> of course. Putin will then escalate by going the full Mikhail. <laughs> and hopefully it will end as I have often dreamed by shooting lasers out of their nipples in space. Are we just suckers for a nice set of abs? 
Are we really reassured of the vigor and virility of our nation simply through the physique of our leaders? Tell us what you think. For Global Pulse, I'm Erin Coker. Link TV, connecting you to the world. Link TV is viewer supported. Watch more at linktv.org.